moment had come. Baja in Mexico and Central America and South America is waiting for us. Hope to bring a lot of nice stuff to you guys that you get inspired by our trips and that we meet you soon somewhere on the road. There it is, the monster is leaving the house. Ready for new adventures. to pick me up. He changed his mind. to the border. This time we did our visa and internet and we printed it. Then it will make it easier to cross to Baja California. And we're excited to be again on the road and to go to Baja. <laughs> International border in 1500 feet. Cool. There we go. We are going to Mar <laughs> He's doing his imports for the car and he did the 10 years importation, what is pretty cool. Do you remember how much it was? Uh, 59... Okay, something. something. Okay, cool. It's a nice surprise to be 10 years in this country. <laughs> and here we have the lady doing all the papers inside there. And soon we are going back to the car and south we go to Baja California. here in Mexico. I'm really sorry guys if it happens that we don't post the video on Sundays because internet is not the best. We are in places that is no connection at all and we never know when we will move on to another place where is internet. Then if you see that we disappear for some Sundays don't be scared, we are only off-grid <laughs> and we will post the video as soon as we have internet again and you guys can still follow our journey but we'll be with a little maybe delay <laughs> It's pretty early in the morning and we are in Mexico and Vascolito is on the front of the car laying his bed. Look at him. Yesterday we did cross the border and we came directly to Rancho La Bellota to visit a friend here and it was pretty nice. I think we have some videos about that and I will show you guys. We have outside our friend Tiag Look at him, I don't know if you guys can see there. Ta da! Yeah, Vasco. And let's see how this morning will be. I need to prepare coffee now with the new coffee uh, stand that Fabian did, that is just here. Our coffee machine. And we'll be pretty good. Can you introduce it to people what you are doing? A sliding door for our coffee maker. Nice. Show what you bought. Braided wood, had two slide doors, 
put something on top of the wood in order to hold the coffee maker and I'm gonna do the finicky stuff right now. So, let's test. First time sliding. Goes all the way in. A little harder than we thought, but that's good. Ta-ta. So this coffee machine, well, hopefully won't move anywhere. Coffee machine in. Ta-da. Coffee machine out. It's not only a coffee machine drawer. We also created for our charging stuff a cushion when we drive off-road. Uh, everything is safe and is charging. So this is our charging base. We have now 230 volt in there, 110 volt and 12 volt. So we're gonna fix that. There it is. We installed here a little light. Oops. It's under our draw. What is purple? I am waking up in the morning, tired. Isabella's already up. So Isabella comes here, opens it up, hopefully, pulls it out, starts the inverter button, wait for the click. We have 230 volt now out of our 12 volt battery system from Reliant. We start it, Woohoo! it's blinking. We're gonna fill it with water. We have now drinking water with our Guzzle H2O system. It's gonna come back. I'm still talking about Isabella doing all this. This is nice while I'm sleeping. We have the water here. Time to enjoy our coffee in the morning. Mm. And now, after our coffee, we will go for a little shower. Raul have here a shower in a toilet. That is pretty nice. And we will go there to see. <laughs> morning. <laughs> Look, <laughs> he's there. <laughs> Good morning, Unicornia. Yeah. Go there for a shower. <laughs> Here it is. We have a little shower and toilet. Look at that. Toilet. Here it is. Here's the shower. We don't know how long we will stay here, but I think maybe one day more, and that's it. If not, we are leaving tomorrow. Bienvenidos a Mexico. Who's here? The guys are deciding for some routes, new routes in Baja, California. This is our third time in Baja. Each time we spend three months. We don't know how many times we will spend this time here. And we want to go to new places. And the guys are giving us some nice advice where to go, what to see new here. Then let's see how will be this journey.